Life update thought post by newest oldest 9.01 a.m. on the 30th of October 2017. That's all for the blog today. Have a great day. Ebony Bowden will be back in the blogging chair tomorrow morning. 8.52 a.m. on the 30th of October 2017. The rumor file was interesting this morning. Listener Tristan told of how a man tried to carjack him in Clyde North yesterday. Tristan had been driving through Clyde North, in Melbourne's southeast, when he came across a man lying on the road. He slowed down to check the man was okay, but was in for a shock. He jumped up onto the bonnet, screaming to open the car up, he said. Tristan managed to get away and put a call into police. He described the assailant of being of African appearance. Listen to the audio of the interview below. 8.41 a.m. on the 30th of October, 2017. Those delays are still persisting on the Kaba Air slash Paykam line. While Metro puts the delays at 40 minutes, some passengers are saying they've been stuck for almost an hour. I should be at work by now. Instead, sitting 100 meters from Clayton Station due to two track faults, at Metro 2, when will you fix these tracks? Mel Pauling, at Mel Pauling, October the 29th, 2017, 8.38 a.m. on the 30th of October, 2017. Have you managed to sniff out today's nine-letter word? The letters were C-A-T-O-Y-O-L-F-R. Here's the answer from Reva Jane. It smells, my olfactory glands say. 8.22 a.m. on the 30th of October, 2017 Police were hunting a man armed with a firearm and a group of his associates after shots were fired at a house in Melbourne East on Sunday afternoon, Joe Hinchliff reports. Mystery surrounds the altercation, but it is believed a teenager was threatened and both he and a group of assailants fled the scene. Check out the full article publisher, logo, height, 60, width, 